It's about you, gentlemen, the baked potatoes want to prepare by the There we go. Good burger. Fred's Market is the oldest open air market in the United States. Very the cool. The original place of the first hurricane. Here's Sammy's filet, which looks really pretty. pretty. Good morning, everybody. Happy New Year. It is January 1st, 2023. Wow, that's crazy to think. And uh, we're still here in NOLA. Woke up. What an amazing night. If you guys didn't see the last video, go watch it. It was awesome. Uh, just a great day in, in New Orleans. We did so much and still so much more to see today. So I think we're going to do a hop on, hop off tour. We're going to go get some great breakfast. I really want to try some beignets and show you guys those, but the lines have been astronomical for them. I mean, I, we had a tour guide yesterday. She told us this, the line for the Cafe du Mont was an hour and a half long. An hour and a half long. So we'll see what we find out and uh, we'll see how the day goes today. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Hit that thumbs up button. We'll see you guys at breakfast. Hotel so we're going to the Peacock Room in the Kempton Hotel. It's really new, so it's kind of a fit to crap. Could be great, could be terrible. Here we are at the Peacock Room. Menu. Sticky buns look pretty intriguing. That's pretty much the whole menu. Kind of eclectic feeling in here. We ordered the, what is that? Sticky the bun. sticky bun. It actually came out different than I thought it would. Amy got a mimosa and then I got a double espresso iced with Bailey's. And then we're gonna do the we're gonna do the burger and, and the BLT. And the BLT. So, all right, we're gonna try the sticky bun. Look at that right there. Is that amazing? I'm telling you, this place had really good reviews. I've had that for dessert. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it for after my food, actually. All right, 10 on the sticky bun, apparently. So here's my burger. Wow, it looks really, I added an egg. So there's my burger, that's the smash burger. It looks beautiful. Look at this BLT. Mm. Yeah. Sammy added real tomato instead of the tomato, tomato jam. jam. This little side salad is so good. I think it's like the size yeah. of the hand. Gotta cut that in half for it. And then we'll get a, we'll get a picture. Oh yeah, we also got grits. They look pretty. Oh wow, that looks amazing. I don't know how that's gonna go. Try to put that in your mouth. There you go. That's a good bite for you. Nice. Mm, that sauce makes it. The egg just did its debut. I missed it though. Oh, that's really pretty. Oh wow, that looks juicy. Oh, win win. Yeah, win win. There we go. Good burger. Peacock burger. And as always, so we like to be fully transparent. Here's the bill. I have to be honest with you, by far the best meal and the best price we've had in Nola. Including everything. I mean, and best food out Dude, there. And look how big the sandwich. You can split this. I have a whole the half. The sandwich. Sammy's taking a whole half of sandwich with her. I'm gonna give it to almost first like we did the other day. And I, I, I can't. I, I mean, it's crazy. She likes to. They're beautiful sandwiches, so she gives it to a homeless person. But there you go. I would come here. Peacock Room raving reviews. We're going to do the hop on hop off tour. We'll see you there. Hey, made it on the big bus. We're on. Here we go. Big bus tour. They said it takes an hour and a half. We make it off though. To get all the way around. And like go do some things. Yeah, but an hour and a half. It's not that bad. No, and you could get off and on whatever you want. Yeah. I saw that yesterday. What was the price of this? 45 each. That's what it was. So $90. Now we're in the middle of the French Quarter right now. We're going to jump straight to our tour right here on the left. His name is Jackson Square. Jackson Square is an asset the store landmark name, of course, for Andrew Jackson. From Here's the Clear. cafe. Dumond line again. This thing has never been shorter than this. But the tour guides say go to Cafe Beignet. Yeah, they say they like it. They do. What happened? So the bus stalled and we can't move. It won't turn off. The bus stalled? <laughs> It'd be hilarious with without <laughs> the power the automatic door doesn't open. We've been on a tour that got hit by that car. <laughs> and now we're on one that's stalled. Oh, there he goes. It, it kicked in. Back in business. All right, so we just got off the hop on, hop off bus. It says it takes like an hour and a half. It took about two. It took about, about two, two hours. hours. I will tell you, they go through some incredible you know. history. 
Uh, they talk about Eli Manning and his family and Peyton Manning's family's restaurant. They talk about um, all of the, oh my gosh, all these trees, they have this green, what, it's a fern. Yeah, it's and it green only fern. comes alive when it rains. Like a, they said it and looks, it's alive right now. Yeah, it looks it's like a, a moss when it's not, but then when it rains, it perks right up and looks like a beautiful fern, and it's like a clay, it's pretty. Yeah, you um, go down the street where Mardi Gras goes. Mardi Gras, you, they, you see the all the bees. Quarter, you go to the Garden District. The Garden District, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So they say cool. homes there are from 200 to 800,000 in some areas. And then from 800 to like multiple million in other Yeah, Beyonce's areas. house is there. Yep. A couple of uh, things with us. Really cool. We passed a cemetery. Oh my That's gosh. Cool. And uh, That's Nicholas where the... Cage pre bought his grave there. Yeah, and it, you'll it see there. it's got this. It's a, it's a pyramid one. And people go and kiss it. And he so has like, to pay a million dollars. No, I don't know how much. It wasn't a million, but it was. He has to pay a fee every two weeks every... to get it clean. Yeah, so they did that. But overall, it was a really good tour. I mean, it showed you everything. And we yeah. Just get a little time. We it was just a. Just a it was. It was a great it. tour. Totally yeah. worth it. Oh, and uh, I'd recommend doing it. So now we're gonna go get some lunch. We're not sure yet where. And Somewhere. <laughs> we'll see you guys there. Yeah. Actually, it looks really pretty. It's gonna be perfect. Uh, lucky dog hot dog since 1948. I think it's still cold. No, they boil them. The other people oh, just. That's why there's no uh, char on it? Yeah. That's not allowed. So what do you think of the hot dog from Lucky Dogs from 1948? Two out of ten. She doesn't do like boiled hot dogs. I do not like boiled hot dogs. Tastes I like thought it was pretty not bad. Rubbery to me. But Sammy never did like boiled hot dogs. No, you gotta They're just boiled, dogs. so she like, thinks look, it doesn't look... It's not that it's not cooked, it's just not crispy. It's like rubbery. Also, we just almost got pulled for a hat scam. Yeah, that was good. The girl comes up to me and goes, excuse me, sir, you can't stand here. This is reserved. For good, looking, good people. looking people and women who show their, their boobs, their boobs. And she just handed them a hat. And I was like, I don't want the hat. And what they do is that when you grab the hat, it's, oh, well, I'm actually taking donations, so if you can buy that hat, can you give me $30? Yeah, they're going to like sell you to you, yeah. Bourbon Live, that's what it's called. Best place, what is it, baby? It's two, two for one drinks. They have a down, dance floor, a balcony, a balcony, and free balcony. Outside, uh, and, and it's, it's, what I'm going to show you right here is this little uh, photo booth that you can send to yourself for yeah. free. And it's empty. And no cover charge. We bought four, yeah. we got four drinks for $14. It's, it is dirt cheap. Come here. Best move. Oh, let me come to the street. This is the back entrance. Yeah, this is the back side of Pat O'Brien's. Wow, no one under 20. Oh, wow. So here you can be, that. they're going to ID you here. They're gonna ID you here to go in. The notorious fire pit. The notorious Pat O'Brien. Very the cool. Original place of the first hurricane. Yeah, there you, yeah, that's what I said. The original hurricane. We don't really drink big drinks. But that's enough. If you want to explore, yeah. so we're going to the Orleans Grapevine. Wow. Yeah, that's peaceful. Little water fountain right there. Look at the water fountain. There we go. So here is the Orleans Grapevine. Let me tell you, this place is just screaming, like, class. It's so nice. Here's the menu. This is a pesto butter. And the fresh bread just came out of the oven, she said. You're gonna love this bread. Oh my god. So anyways, I'm doing the primary special. I asked her to make sure, I wanted to make sure that even though it was from last night, it would still be medium rare, and she said yes, it'll be amazing. I'm excited for it. Look at that crunch. Oh my god. It's so hot, I can't even touch it. Sammy is gonna order probably a baked brie. And uh, is, is, don't you just hear how peaceful this is here? Just listen to that. Oh my gosh, we got a lot coming at you, but. All right, so a little update. We are not actually doing the brie because the bread kind of sufficed it uh, in there. Let me tell you, their butter they had was incredible. Um, so what we're actually gonna do, we're gonna taste the scallops to get a little seafood. We're gonna do their house-made tomato soup this evening. And then Sammy's gonna do a Caesar salad. So that's what we are doing to start. We will show you that. 
and it's just been a great night so far. All right, so here is Sammy's uh, Caesar. Wow, they, they have do like, like fried Parmesan. cheese. I think it's Parmesan clusters. It is, it's like Parmesan. That's yeah. so good. They did Parmesan chips. Really cool mm. there. That's the homemade soup. And then these are the scallops. Those look pretty, baby. They do look pretty. All right, so Sam is going to try a bite of her Caesar. Now, we've had a lot of Caesars in a lot of different places. Honest opinion. Good, bad. The chips are cool, but what's the actual taste? The great Caesar. Not the best I've had. Yeah. But really, really good. Is it dressed enough? Yeah. Okay, well, that's good. It looks lightly dressed. Mm -hmm. It's pretty that's good, good. The good. cheese does it. Nice. Pretty. All right, I'm just going to try the scallop one. You want to try with the special sauce in the middle? New Orleans scallop. What is it? I haven't had a scallop in a long time. These are not that fishy, which is good. So it's a good scallop. From the bayou, it's bayou. They do like a, it's like a pecan. It does, it does say pecan for whatever reason. They like pecans here for sure. Wow. It's a sweet rice. Oh, it's that's a probably kick. a good combo. A sweet rice with a little kick. <laughs> there you go. That thing is There's the primer right there, which is absolutely no, no. It's huge. The, it's the thickness. Yeah, it's, it's like three inches. It's massive. And here's Sammy's filet, which looks really pretty. pretty. With vegetables and that. Blue cheese sauce. Yeah, it looks really pretty. That thing is, she was not kidding. When he, when he ordered it, she goes, or she was explaining it, she goes, they're like really big. Mm -hmm. And I wasn't expecting it to be like four inches It's thick, huge. Dude. All right, so let me try it. Gotta ask for medium. Is that rare? Perfect. Yeah, it's a medium rare. Well, we're gonna do a little update. We never complain about anything. I will tell you. Just, just show them. I will tell you. I ordered medium rare the first time for my steak, and it came out medium rare. Okay. Kind of. Medium. No, it did. It looked medium, medium rare, but it was ice cold when I so in the cold. center, like ice, ice cold. Like literally, like crazy. So they sent it back, and now they comes back like medium well. I don't. We might even look redder in the camera, but it. Trust me. No. Give you a comparison. Sammy ordered hers, however, medium. medium. I'm just not in the mood for medium rare. What do you mean? And it, it came comes out the first time. rare, which I would have eaten. But Sammy doesn't I like sent rare. It back to get it medium. To get it medium. We're so easy going it about it. Like, and she got it. Still it's still rare. medium rare. It's like the perfect medium rare. Yeah. But like you can't, oh no, you can't see it because of the sauce. It's. It's. It's it's a it's it's what I would eat. So you have something that I ordered medium rare. It's like literally well, medium well. And Sammy, who ordered medium, is a is rare. So we should probably complain, but it, it was it was this. It started out so amazing. It started out so amazing. Oh my gosh! I should have showed you. Oh my god! I should have showed him the potato. And you missed yeah, it. My twice baked potato. Actually, the inside was great, but the funniest part is I ate the inside. Well, they didn't cook two thirds of it, so it was it was hard as a rock. So we'll show you the bill. That was our dinner. Pretty average. And then it hit like rock bottom. Unfortunately. And they say it is though. But he doesn't like spicy. And he doesn't like uh, Creole, and I don't like seafood, so we maybe just go to the wrong. But I'll tell you this: place. we never complain, but it was average at best. So this is medium rare, and this is medium. Mint's supposed to be. Yeah. Set. So, all right, we're heading out of here. Okay. All right, so here's the bill. My prime rib was sixty-two dollars. It was a special. So we didn't know. It was a special. I don't ever ask the price; I just pay it. But That's just there you go, sixty-two oh four for this place. No, uh, worth it. Our breakfast was better. Our breakfast. Oh my goodness. What a good boy. I know. Two horses go into a bar. Actually, I got a joke for that, but I know. Right? It sounds like one. <laughs> Straight up in the bar. Sammy got a shirt. That's actually really cool. I don't know if you can hear us, but for $20, you can buy a New Orleans fire department from the fire department from the fire department a t-shirt they're selling them Look how cool that is it goes to their fire department house fund for food and everything going to Frenchman Street for a music what did we call these 
He calls them rickshaw. We call them pedicab. I think Petty in America, cab. but I think they're really big in India where they call them rickshaw. rickshaws. Rickshaws. You know why? I think I've watched Jackass too many times, mm. and they've done a lot of stunts with some rickshaws. Hoping you would just be cultured, but now it's Jackass. <laughs> <laughs> we're pedicabbing. Pedicabbing. And we're going to listen to music yep. and have fun. And get out of Burbank. Then we may head to Harrah's. Maybe get some pho later. Yeah. Because dinner was so fantastic. <laughs> BP in the house, y'all. BP. Bring your own chives, bring your own butter. <laughs> So we're maybe gonna, so we just hit blue, what was it called? Blue, anyways, blue moon. Blue moon. Anyway, so, we, so, so the guy that the ricocheted us here, yes, we got <laughs> he the said to go to that place, which we went to the other night, which was better tonight. That's right. Very fun, yeah. Then we talked to the uh, bouncer. And he said there's a place called the John the that's John. actually 25 and up. Now think about that, that's 25. Yep. He said order. they tried to keep out the riffraff, which is totally off our yep. alley. So we're gonna go try to try to find that. We're gonna try to find. The, I think it's called the John because he it's said the it's called the John. Theme. Yeah, toilet theme. Yeah. So I guess. That's so the we're gonna go try to find the John and uh, maybe get a drink there, and then uh, we'll see how it goes. Hope you guys have been uh, enjoying the video so far. Me and Sammy are currently walking Still down. Still on the way to the John. We're walking down Frenchman Street. Let me tell you, the John is pretty far down here. So we're walking down now. It's it's like two blocks past where Frenchman really kind of pops, I would say. Yeah. <clears throat> so hopefully the guy was kind right. of down here, no man's land. So <laughs> hopefully he was right. He could be sending us to also no man's land. So uh, we'll see you guys there. We are in the John. There's the John. Look, I'm on a John. You are actually on a toilet. He is, pretty much. But uh, I thought this was going to be a John bar. It's not. It's all good. We are heading it's to. Bar. Yeah, it's a local bar. We're heading to Harris. I mean, it's cute. It's my local bar. It's very town. Hey, we'll see you at Harris. So, since our, honestly, our dinner was so terrible, unfortunately, I mean, it started out great, but you know, you saw it ended. We got Bifo at Haraz. Yeah, Bifo at Haraz. And I'm really excited, honestly. I mean, listen, this really is like $30, I think. Less but than that. But look how beautiful oh, it is. God, it just good. looks pretty, so. We got extra bean sprouts, which Extra I bean sprouts, which Sammy loves. Some poison sauce. Poison. I'm excited. We're gonna eat I this. I chicken, they don't have chicken. Yeah, they don't have chicken, only beef. You only get beef, yep. but honestly. Okay, beggars can't be choosers. Gotta be better than earlier. That's right. We're gonna eat this, and uh, this may be the sign-off. So if it is, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I hope you guys uh, subscribe, like, and comment on this video. My wife is stunning. Last, if it's the last video, I hope you guys have a good time. We have a whole another day tomorrow. We're gonna have such a good time tomorrow. My foe, I'll let you know how it is in the morning. But overall, like, subscribe. And it might not be the last time we talk, so. And we'll see you guys tomorrow.